Hello! This is a Nintendo Direct reaction from E3 2021. I'm watching this a bit later. This is the recorded version that a friend of mine sent me so that I wouldn't be spoiled. But I had to work. So I am filming this reaction at two and a half hours after this originally aired. But I have not been spoiled on anything, so all these reactions will be 100% genuine. Now that said... Man, anything I think I'm gonna say, I think there's a solid chance that we get both of the final Smash Fighters. Not a guarantee. We're definitely getting one, but like, both? I can see it happening. Big way to close out the Fighters Pass right here at E3. Other than that, I'm really not sure what else to expect. So we're just gonna jump in. See what we got. And it's good. Ah, they're still giving the COVID one. And volume, okay, we're good. Right, I have some bingo cards below me that I'm doing with the group, so if I look down, I may be checking something off. Oh, faces! I'm Shino Takahashi, and I'll be your guide for today's Nintendo Direct. Hi, Mr. Takahashi. And oh, he's hmm. Is the Odyssey Nintendo guy. System is now in its fifth year. And many fifth people around year. the world are playing games on it. Nintendo Switch is being enjoyed by a wide range of players. Which is why the Pro is not happening at this direct. They confirmed that in a tweet beforehand, exclusively well, software. We've been able to offer a wide variety of What's I lost all the sound, and oh, I should not have unfull screened it. I don't, I'm not looking at any of that. But, what happened? I went on. Computer just decided to mute for no reason. Let me back it up a tad. I think we've been able to offer a wide variety of games on okay. the system. Not just from Nintendo. But also from our many developments and publishing Yes, we'll see many of those partners today too, I'm sure. Each of you watching this Nintendo Direct but what's with the yellow frame around personal taste? The uh, direct right now. That Zelda related. Look at that yellow frame. On a selection of games releasing this year. We hope you enjoy it. Okay, to begin, please take a look at this video. Two of them. Two snaps. That means two fighters, right? Not actual gameplay footage, but this is totally... This is a Smash environment. It looks like the Sephiroth trailer. Oh. 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 What? Huh? What the heck? That's... Cast him into the fire. Hazuya? I've never heard of this guy. Um, clearly he's from a fighting game. And they didn't do the little smash thing. So, what? Huh? I need to back it up a bit because it froze. Oh my god. I've been waiting all day for this. And they're gonna pull this on me. Which game is he from? There's so many fighters out there. I, I don't know what game this is. Oh, and he's got another stage kind of like King of Fighters. Now he's tossing... I love how it's Ganon and Captain Falcon because they're basically in men's arm. How many is he gonna throw off? I didn't know he could do that. Is this a blaze blue thing or a... what's the other one? Guilty Q? 
I'm trying to think of any fighting game I know to see if this can ring even the slightest bell. Samurai Showdown? Oh, no, he doesn't have a sword. What am I, what am I saying? Anushima? Tell me what game this is. Tekken! Oh, I didn't think of Tekken. Okay, that makes some sense. Tekken's been around a while. He's gonna float right back up, because he wasn't dead. All that. We're not getting the whole Sakurai Presents on this right now, right? Kazuya Mishima from the fighting game series Tekken will join the battle. Surprise! I'll go over the details at a later date. Yeah, that's what I thought. Tight. For today, though, we've prepared a short video to showcase Kazuya's moves in Super Smash Brothers Ultimate. Okay, so we do get a little bit of the detail. Nami Kick, Viren Edge, Flash Punch Combo. I don't think this guy is going to be my go-to anytime soon, especially with Pyra and Mithra staying out. Like, I've never been one for the traditional fighting games. I'm barely into Smash. I'm not very good at it. But I, I liked Terry. When they added Terry, but I have a good time with Terry whenever I play him, so I'm not saying that he's automatically going to be bad for me. And there's Terry now. I am not asking it to mute. This feels like Tekken. No, it's Super Smash Brothers Ultimate. I'll talk about the fighter more in a future presentation. If that mute thing happens one more time, I may need to pause and adjust something. The air date is shown below. Please stay tuned. So, a little less than two weeks. Thank you, Mr. Sakurai. New fighter, Kazuya. Uh, when I saw Ganon in someone's arms at a giant volcano, I thought we were getting some new Zelda remake. Please look forward to seeing how Kazuya... Uh, or Breath of the Wild 2 stuff, but it didn't look like Breath of the Wild 2 again, and it looked like Gerudo again. Alright, let's fly through the stuff now. Your choices matter in these emotional Life is strange? Rain... Rain going by, DMCA is waiting to happen, and it's 2D and it made it so it isn't Life is Strange. Oh wait, maybe it is? That kind of looks like the Life is Strange character, doesn't it? Alright, and that's Alex. So they made an animated trailer to say it's coming to Switch. Because that's Alex in the middle from through Cut. They're both coming to Switch. Wow, I can actually play these. Okay. I did not see that coming. And that's probably not on my bingo card. Um, unless there was unexpected port or something. Gameplay footage not final. Yeah, there's no way it looks this good on Switch. Right, right, right. I gotta keep talking though because copyright, you never know. Life is strange. True colors launches on Nintendo Switch September 10th. That's the same day as the other versions. Remastered collection. Comes to Nintendo Switch later. Wait, why does why does that one come later? I feel like they should have prioritized that. On the Nintendo Switch system. Hi. Are Star Lord leading a legendary band? Guardians of the Galaxy coming to. Um, and I'm just. Is this working? Okay. But now my camera's frozen. 
Um, right now I gotta fix the camera, I guess. Just wanted to film this because someone was interested in it. How long has my face been frozen? Oh, I unplugged the webcam when I unplugged the mic. Gosh. No, I am not trying to use screen link. And no, I'm not trying to use the virtual camera either. Oh my god, this could not be going any worse. I did not expect all these tech issues during a simple reaction film. Okay, back. And hopefully no more muting. On a wild ride across the cosmos, overwhelm opponents with Star Lord's daring combat style. I am not interested in the Marvel universe, so I'm also not interested in the Marvel games. I am. I'm sorry to say. But I didn't find this interesting at the Square Enix conference, and I don't find it interesting now. But, you know, more options are good for people. Ah, uh, worms. I tried it once. It seemed fun, and then I was terrible at it. Ah, uh, god, they went all, uh, they went all daily update on it. Available for free for two weeks after launch. A new map, Spaceport Showdown, launches with Worms Rumble, wriggling onto Nintendo. Yeah, Switch so far nothing amazing. Discount when you pre-order the game Good change. On Nintendo e -shop. Good change. The fantastical realm of Orcan. I've never heard of this. As you explore this fully hand-painted world, you'll customize a team of demigods and unleash. This is a strange little reel. Like, hey, here's the reel where we show. Guardians of the Galaxy, and whatever this is, and Worms. Like, why are those together? What's the connection here? Of course the two-point game is coming to the Switch as well. The other ones are on the Switch. I heard about this at two other E3 conferences, so of course. Lots of creative tools are at your disposal to make the school yours and take your educational empire to the next level. Educational empire. Oof. Campus starts on Nintendo Switch next year. A beloved series role. 20th anniversary. anniversary this year. That's bananas. No. Oh, they didn't put Donkey Kong in space, did they? Okay, those were bananas. Oh, God. The first one. The second one. Are they actually putting these games on the console? Guys, sign me up. But if this is just a real, then what is it building to? Oh, all of that? All of that. Just the first three. Why did you show the... Why did you show the other ones if it was just the first three? Look, I'm happy. I really enjoyed the games originally. Go bananas, win Super I've still got one and two on the GameCube. On to Nintendo Switch, October 5th. I feel like that was leaked at some point, too, so I should have seen that coming. It's a blast from parties past. And you're invited. Top 100 on Switch? Ready for another round of Mario Party Mayhem? Of course you are. It's a Wait, board? Of Mario Party boards and mini games. Okay. Live it up on Mario on screen, by the way. I can take my free space. Birthday cake and space land. Each board is packed with zany events. Ah, uh, I mean, I'm down. Will this have the online that Mario Party now has? If you want to call that a facelift. All of which support button control. So is this what Top 100 should have been? The Mario Party series catalog, you'll have a blast in this all-star fun fest. Here's a little party favor. All 
all game modes work with online play. All of them, yay! Even if you're partying solo, you can randomly match with other party goers worldwide. Playing a board okay, that's neat. With friends, save your progress mid-game, grab a snack, then resume the festivities. Grab a These snack indeed. Communicate with others. It's time to party in Mario Party Superstars. Launching on the Nintendo Switch system. Okay, I mean, I need to see more details, but consider me intrigued. What did you think? Before we show this next trailer, I'd like to say one thing. Currently, we're working hard on the latest game in the Metroid Prime series, Metroid Prime 4. That means it's a 2D Metroid. But today, we'd like to introduce another new entry in the Metroid franchise. Please take a look. I like Samus Returns in Super. At Troy. Oh, it's actually happening. Is that what it's called? At least I have footage for this one. So it's finally happening for those fans. Congratulations, all you people. A lot of people are screaming right now. I'm not a long-term fan enough to even know what the story was leading up to 5. But I'm happy for you. An interesting suit, by the way. And that thing looks straight out of Portal. But what is this design, man? Do we have the melee? Maybe we don't. Oh, it is called Dread. Yeah, the melee counter's back. Very black and white. At least in that one area. Oh, stealth. And oh man. I tried Red will be on Treehouse. Do we have a date? We have a date! <laughs> Metroid fans can finally be happy about something. For the first new 2D Metroid game in roughly 19 years. I love how they acknowledge it. Dread game. As the name Dread implies, this is a Metroid game with a new feel showcasing a variety of threats that Samus will encounter. It's scheduled to be... How many threats? So it won't be too long until launch. Ah, no, it's not long at all. That same day, we'll also oh god, now I gotta find my amiibo buying button. The, Emmy, the, robot seen in the, the Emmy. Nominate this game for an Emmy, why don't you? Headlines. These familiar franchises are back on Nintendo Switch. Oh, they're going for all the nostalgia today. Get ready to get down. The latest, just okay, well, hold on. That that one's definitely copyrighted. <laughs> yeah. uh, just gonna wait this out. I muted on purpose this time. Let me know when you're done just dancing. I mean, it's fine and all. I know people like it. I don't oh, know. I feel like you can be a lot quicker to say, hey, here's what's in the game. Never heard of it. Never heard of it. Blast your way through nearly 30 over the top track. Sweet track though. Is that a Pegasus? So pick your favorite vehicle and hit the road. My favorite vehicle is the Pegasus, thank you for asking. Blast launches as a console exclusive on Nintendo Switch. I am Donut. It's the ultimate Dragon Ball Z experience. Another licensed property that I don't particularly care about. 
Bless I knew that is a title. I don't know, does that beat out Dragon Quest XI S Echoes of an Elusive Age Definitive Edition? Or does it beat out Leighton's Mystery Journey Catrail and the Millionaire's Conspiracy Deluxe Edition? I don't know, but that is certainly a title. Very big title, that. You don't say. How much? How many meals can you make out of that fish alone? Bigger than Goku. The boss battle episode, the new power awakens parts one and two is also included. Dragon Ball Z Kakarot plus a new power awakens set punches its way onto Nintendo Switch. September I swear, if that whole title's on the cover and not just DBZ Kakarot. Yeah, reminder, this comes out. Uh huh. The Mario Golf Super Rush game launches soon. Here's a quick glimpse into each of the modes. Multiple modes. Take your time to read the wind and terrain on the green. I know how standard golf works. Hit different types of shots and aim. Of course, they don't usually have giant sand beasts in standard golf. Nice birdie. Speed golf. Smack your ball, then chase after it. Be the first to get your ball in the hole. Outpace the Ooh. Special dashes and special shots. Battle golf. Duke it out over nine flag marked holes in an obstacle filled arena. Capture Ain't like an arena. Golf adventure. I'm looking forward to golf adventure. With your me character. The golfing challenges that await may surprise you. Ultras. And here's some news. Free updates are planned for Oh, that looks sweet. Additional courses and playable characters. The fairway's almost open. So set your tee time and get ready to Oh, like right. none of the courses and tennis aces look quite that sweet. Nintendo Switch system June 25th. Pre-orders are available now. I knew they would show that one at the treehouse. Ready for the ride of a lifetime? Time to see this trailer for the fourth time in all of E3. Oh no, we actually got gameplay. As a writer in this RPG adventure, you'll explore You know, Capcom could have shown this at their conference instead of just another trailer. Gather materials such as honey and ore, then use them to craft items for your journey. But beware of the many monsters roaming about. Some are docile, but others may suddenly ambush you. To fight, you'll team up with your monstie and use weapons and skills to overwhelm The term monstie is just battles. so... Win, and you'll be rewarded I know that they want to distinguish the monster that you actually have control over versus the monsters that are just out there. But they could have thought of them better, couldn't they? To hatch a new Incredibly powerful monsties can also hatch from rare eggs. Need more traveling, buddy? Join up with friends and they'll switch online sold separately a Nintendo account required to okay it's going to be a real monster of an adventure monster hunter stories 2 wings of ruin soars onto Nintendo switch July 9th yep boy you can play the free demo on June 25th and carry over your save data to the full game gave us a date for the demo here's a new game from the head all right that survey leak was real Ha <laughs> ha Did you miss me? Hey, What's with the background? Who am I? It's -a me, Wario. Yeah. It's a finally ready, a brand new game from my company. Check it out. Back at that company. Control me. Time to do this. <laughs> Look at me go. Okay. Check out these chumps. They came back. They have wonderful new talent. Oh, you can play as all of them. Throw that stick thing. Hmm, not so bad. Use the spinny whatchamacallit. <laughs> Nailed it. Same micro game, different abilities. Oh. Yeah, that's actually a good way to change it up. Two people can play together at the same time. Yay. Yes. Get ready for some micro 
game of mayhem. I will. <laughs> the WarioWare Get It Together game launches exclusively on the Nintendo Switch system September 10th. You don't say. It's not on PS5. Game with Wario. What you just saw was a trailer for WarioWare. Get It Together. Uh-huh. In the latest installment of this series, there are new micro games that let you control Wario and his friends. There is also a two player co op mode, which greatly expands the gameplay. Yes. It's releasing in the near future, so stay tuned. Next, please take a look at this. So we're starting to see some solid titles between Metroid, that, SMT5. Hey, we kind of knew about this one, so this is going to be one of the longer trailers, hey? I mean, people have been waiting on this one. But that reality is Probably longer than people have been waiting on Prime 4 at this point. A different dimension. Oh, you know what? I'm going to have to check with the group if Metroid Prime 4, anything on the bingo card, includes that mention that it's still being worked on. Um, let's see. Apocalyptic world where angels and demons what else have I got on this card? <laughs> I'm sorry, I just know I'm not going to play this game because it's notoriously difficult. Suddenly, you're fused with the Special edition. Gaining the power to fight. Fighters pass stuff. What lies ahead in this alternate realm? Big shadow drop. Donkey Kong Demon infested wasteland. Though friendly demons do exist here, um, they are hostile and will attempt to destroy you. Harness your new I wonder if golf counts for unexpected free DLC. Their weak point is that might be considered expected. I'll have to check with the group. The number of consecutive actions you can perform in a combo will increase. Though demons are formidable. Opponents, <laughs> you may be able to recruit them via negotiations, which begin when you open a conversation. Dot, with dot, them. Dot. Man, I love how I'm not even looking there, I'm looking at all this stuff that was on the bingo card, and how we're not really getting any of it. That's okay, we got some neat stuff. I'm just I was disappointed that I'm not even close to winning Bingo. Motivated and join me as an ally. Demons that do join will I could fast forward because this is not the live version. By fusing demon allies, another demon can be created. And fusion. The newly fused demon's innate abilities will vary, granting you a powerful ally customized to your needs and playstyle. So, I mean, I can recommend Tokyo Mirage Sessions as a game that uses a lot of these mechanics, but isn't this game, and also is very different. Oh, that means it's a- that's a week before Pokemon. was the latest trailer for Shin Megami Tensei 5 from Atlas. Yep, finally happening. This is the newest game in the series. Please look forward to future updates. Okay. Let's see a few more Nintendo Switch headlines. That's what we got. Celebrate 10 years of Dangan I predicted this last time. Frickin' heck. Ahem, ahem. Testing, testing. I hate you so much right now. I swear. I've played these games, so I don't think I decadent. All three. All three. Oh my god. Uh, I predicted this last time. Is to betray the other students. And so it begins. Also, the word ass was on the screen in a Nintendo Direct. I'm just 
trial will take place and reveal the culprit. You're the culprit, aren't you, Mew? Sorry, I had no idea. They probably moved the body there. Use the evidence you've gathered to refute contradictions and find the guilty. I do like the approach to trials in this game. It's very fun. Uh, the writing leaves something to be desired, but I don't regret playing them. I'm not going to play them again on Switch. There's no reason. Board. Board game. What? Characters from the Duncan Rumpa series will come together to battle at a tropical resort. Why? The strongest of them all in his ultimate beach brawl. The four game collection Duncan Rumpa Oh my god. Launches as a physical exclusive on Nintendo. Physical exclusive. Wow, they're copying Devolver. The games will also be individually available on Nintendo eShop. Okay. 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 I called it. I put this on the bingo card. Heck yes. In this horror adventure game, we'll uncover the mystery. I'm finally getting somewhere on bingo. Deadly Masakami, believed to be at the center of many disappearances. Ah, I almost put this up on Wii U. I heard good things about it, but now I guess I won't. Face your fears as you explore a variety of unsettling locations. In Pokemon Snap, looks a lot darker than I remember. The chilling story features various protagonists, letting you experience the game from different perspectives. New costumes and photo modes are included in this version. Oh wow, costume. Mount Hikami and stay alive. Fatal Frame, Maiden of Black Water, creeps on... It's gotta be October. Gotta be. And DLC. Today. Okay, so that's why they had to say and DLC. Ancient Gods Part 1. Deeper and more challenging combat awaits as you eliminate Hell's newest threats in demon infested ruins and rain swept terrain. Fate of the cosmos is in your hands. Get slaying when this campaign explodes on Nintendo Switch later today. Hmm. Get ramped up for two iconic skateboarding games. Hi, Tony. Mastered in HD. Skate to era defining the legendary Tony Hawk. Take your sessions on the go with all the original game modes. And compete locally or online to show off your tricks against other skaters. Drop into Tony Hawk's Pro Skater 1 and 2, launching on Nintendo Switch June 25th. Pre orders are available. That's now. the same day as golf. After 4,000 years, the heck is this? Witch Queen has risen from the dead, and only one group of heroes can stop her the Strange Brigade. In this thrilling adventure, You'll blast through an army of mummified monstrosities while solving puzzles in booby trap dungeons. Go it alone. Dude, the puzzles. Other daring adventurers in local wireless co-op and online play. Expect the unexpected when Strange Brigade launches on Nintendo Switch. Later. I mean, I don't know. You go underground, of course I expect a skeleton with a pirate sword. It's a new adventure of cosmic proportions. Yep, recap that this exists from the Ubisoft conference. Mario and his friends will team up with the rabbits once again to restore order to the galaxy. That's a good game. Definitely picking this one up. Evil from plunging the universe into chaos. I really like the look of it. Rabbit Rosalina joins them. Wait, is she bored already? Explore planets filled with quirky residents and even quirkier secrets. And in this fresh take on the tactical genre, our heroes can run freely around the battlefield, creating yep. new strategic and chaotic possibilities. Herman, no grid. Aim for victory. With a Pack range, for yes, but grid, no. Wait, who's that? Well, one thing's certain. This is gonna be one heck That could still be Rabbit Bowser. I don't know if it is, Mario but it could. Sparks of hope. The hair is very Space similar, just a very Nintendo different Switch color. Next year. And not final. Did I know what this is? Advance Wars? Ah, 
Wow, okay. Unexpected revival. I think I can check that off. I'll check with the group, but I'm pretty sure this counts. Do 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 do. Thrilling stories, memorable characters, and vibrant gameplay are in. I'm sure people are gonna say that this looks terrible. Like, what were they thinking with the art style? It's way too toy-like. Well, like you're getting the first two games. They're acknowledging this franchise exists. I don't think it's for me because I'm more the Fire Emblem kind where you have the same units throughout the whole game. Like, I tried Wargroove and hated it. We're at the last one already? And it's the Age of Calamity DLC. Ah yes, the master cycle. Oh, neat. Oh, double neat. I'm 100% at the game. The, the DLC is... I'm playing it without question, but... Is that the... Can or was that Impa? For a second, I thought that was Pura, because we're all expecting Pura and Robbie. Zelda's the one on the motorcycle. <laughs> That's available very soon. Wait, I can pause this and read, unlike when it's live. Your challenge is in the Royal Lab. New enemies, higher ranking Wizros. Giant choo choos or apocalyptic difficulty? No thing. Added weapon types: flail for Link and Master Sword. <laughs> a new character: battle-tested guardian. All right, yeah. I hope there's enough to really play around with. Hello there. I'm Eiji Aonuma. Producer of the, Legend of the rest of this is Zelda Anniversary. What you've just seen is a trailer for the first wave of DLC for the Hyrule Warriors Age of Calamity expansion pass from Koei Tecmo Games. It will follow Link and his allies through more battles that took place 100 years prior to the events of... Now we get to hear more about the sequel to Breath of the Wild. I look forward to it. I have a few more things to share with you all today. A few? We'll begin with the Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword HD. The thing we knew about. Next month. You'll immerse yourself in the role of Link by using two Joy-Con controllers for instance. Knew this. We knew this. Knew this. Knew this. Wielding the sword via flicking the sword. Oh, that new blue light. This game depicts the oldest era in the Legend of Zelda series. Knew this. How it all began. What? It amazes me how much they can spend time on things that they've already announced. Named Zelda becomes a legend for future generations. These will all be unraveled in this game. We hope you're looking forward to The Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword HD. Next up. Oh god, not this again. This is a Game & Watch system that lets you play three games in the Legend of Zelda series. Uh, the original Legend of Zelda games reaches its 35th anniversary. Do I get to check off Zelda 2 Remake because of this? Other Nintendo Switch games planned. We've been working on this Game & Watch Because I'm sure Zelda 2 is on there. ...to help mark the occasion and reflect fondly on the earliest days of The Legend of Zelda. Does it come with that stand? It will come with the first game in the series, The Legend of Zelda... Zelda 2, The Adventure of Link. Not a remake. A hey, Game Boy version of The Legend of Zelda. Really? Awakening. That one. As well as a special version of the Game & Watch titled Vermin, starring Link as the playable character. Link so Scott Hammers. On one system from longer Legend of Zelda games to the pick-up-and-play game Vermin. 
In addition, regarding the, the clock functionality for the Game & Watch system, we've added a playable clock based on The Legend of Zelda. Wait, playable as in you can move around? After Zelda 2, The Adventure of Link. You can play with both of them by taking control of Link. Couldn't do that on the Mario one. It was just a, it was just a regular clock. Game and watch system. Whenever Ugh, everything's November. All right. Here's the last thing we have to show you. This Wild is the sequel to the Legend of Zelda: Breath of the Wild. Two years have passed since we first announced this game, and we've been unable to share anything with you in that time. However, development has been steadily progressing. For today, we've prepared some new footage to show a bit more of the game. Please take a look. Alright, Breath of the Wild is one of the few Zeldas I've actually played, beaten, and enjoyed. Oh. Hit me with it. Airy. Bye, Zelda. Time to play as you, right? Now, wherever you are down there. Oh, no, we're not playing a Zelda, but we are... We are somewhere. Who the heck knows where we are? Jesus is back. Whatever just happened there. Oh my god. Now, whatever's down there is mad. That's all we get, isn't it? So, what did you think? This time around, the setting for the adventure has been expanded to include the skies above Hyrule. We'd like to ask you to wait a bit longer. We're aiming for a 2022 release, so I hope you'll look forward to it. Alright, so keeping up the yearly Zeldas. How was that? That's all for this Nintendo Direct. We are diligently continuing development on a number of other games we didn't show today. I hope you'll continue looking forward to what's in store on Nintendo Switch. Thank you for watching. All right, so that's that. So there were a few things that were kind of cool, but you know, nothing to me. But I guess that's what I expected. All right. Check places down below if you ever want to chat more about this, but I'm going to call it there because with the tech issues, this has already gone on long enough. Bye.